do you feel that there could possibly be an emerging candidate from the Tea Party, the Tea Party nation, or? Well, I, you know, I, I don't know that I'd say that that's where it's going to come. That person is going to come from. I think that it should be an emerging candidate for conservatives all over America, probably within the Republican Party, and probably somebody that I hope the Tea Party people can support. I, I, I've, I've told them, and I mean this, that you have to think about what your goals are. That has to stay at the top of your mind all the time. What are your goals? And if their goals are to reduce the size of government, greater individual freedom, less taxation, if those are your goals, what's what are the what's the best path to get there? And I think that path is within the party structure. To me, the, Rep the Republican Party is just simply a mechanism. It's only a, a way to get from point A to point B. Um, I have no loyal to loyalty to it as some sort of entity. It's just a thing, just a mechanism. And that right now is the best mechanism, I think, to get to the point of achieving the goals the Tea Party wants. If, I assure you, if, I, if there was another party, if, if the Tea Party became a political party and it could achieve those goals, we could elect people, fine with me, man, fine with me. I couldn't care less that it's, that it's not a Republican. Uh, it's just that right now, I think that's where it has to be. And what do you feel that this generation should leave for the next generation? Man, if I could just get people to understand what this country is all about. Th the greatest fear I have is a civic ignorance that is not unique to this generation, let me tell you. It's, it's certainly in mine. It's throughout the system. But you know what? If, if, if we could reinvigorate, re-energize the whole process of learning about America, about the America that the founders put together, not the one that has been, um, not the history that's been rewritten by, by uh, the cult of multiculturalism or the, the crowd of politically correct uh, historians, but the real America. Uh, if, if I could see a group of young people coming up who understood it, you know, appreciated it, that would be the greatest gift I think that this country could ever have. Well, thank you very much, Tom. It's a pleasure to meet you.